Morning, the sun is shining and uh, it's always shining on Logan Gilbert down here. 32 victories over the past three seasons. Uh, Logan, there's a buzz down here. There's excitement, obviously it's spring training, but uh, how exciting is it to just have everybody back in camp finally? Again? Yeah, it's so fun. We've been waiting for so long and since the end of last season, not getting what we wanted to come back here and get ready. Um, looking around the team, it's, it's probably the best team I've seen here in however many years, so we're really excited to get going. And, and you've seen some good teams down here. You're on a playoff team. They went 190, 190, 88 last season. Let's talk about this starting rotation. How good is this rotation? Yeah, I think one of the best in the league, I, I would say, um, especially with the young guys, uh, Bryce and Brian, we saw what they did last year, really holding their own, excited what they do in year two. But top to bottom, I think we have some really good guys. Cal Raleigh. That is not an easy job he has catching you guys. I mean, you guys are throwing in the hundreds, then you bring the bullpen yeah. in. Uh, how good is he right now? It's tough. Uh, I, I don't know how he does it. Um, it's really impressive what he does, knowing everybody, and not to mention what he's doing on the hitting side of things. It's hard enough just to be a catcher and deal with us pitchers. We're kind of high maintenance at times. But hitting, you know, 30 bombs, leading the league and caught stealing, he's, uh, he's proven himself as one of the best in the league already. Scott Service said yesterday, Logan, you guys left with a sour taste in your mouths after last season. You tasted the playoffs. You got the victory in Toronto, lost to Houston. You were part of that team. Last year, you don't make the playoffs. Julio Rodriguez says, we are hungrier than ever. Just your thoughts on this season as we move forward and a statement to all the fans up in Seattle watch this morning. Yeah, I mean, we're ready to go. They nailed it. Um, Julio saying we're hungrier than ever. I, I, we're right on the verge. We saw that last year. We upgraded our team, got some key pieces here. We know what it's like to be in the playoffs from a couple years ago. I think this is the year that we make a run. All right. He is Logan Gilbert. He's ready to roll. First game once again down here in Arizona is going to be Saturday. You're going to pitch probably next week sometime, but you start kind of slow, only a yep. couple innings, correct? Getting built up. I'm itching to get out there, but i got to take my time and build it up a little bit. Okay, Jake Whitmer, I know you're coaching your own little league team. If you need Logan to pitch a couple innings, let us know. Yeah. We'll try to bring him up here for you. Yeah, the impact on those kids for Logan would be amazing. How early did these Mariners players get up for training? Oh, my goodness, they must just train around the clock, Chris. And they want to ask, Jake wants to know, how early do you get, do you get out here? I mean, you're, you're here, Brian, early, 6 a.m., uh, right? Yeah, 6, 45, 7, around there. Um, Cal's in here at, like, 5.30. I don't know wow. how he does it. So those catchers, like we yeah, talked about, they have a hard time. It, it's, it's, and, then you th and then when you start throwing games into the mix, uh, it is a long day and a long year, but uh, they're ready to go. There so let's go. send it back to you guys. Some inspiration down in the desert. So excited for this weekend against the White Sox. Thanks, Chris. Thanks, Logan.